It's a race for the line. Whose arms up first? Mark Cavendish is the answer. Cavendish looks around. Cavendish has it. He takes the win. His second of the week. And in doing so, the general classification as well. Il est parti tôt, Marc Cavendish, pour une troisième victoire consécutive sur le Tour de France. Marc Cavendish, maillot vert du Tour pour la première fois de sa carrière. This is where the race can be won on this straight as they go into the last kilometer. Everybody's right up there. Pataki's there, Hushoft is there, and so too is Marc Cavendish. Hushoft is up there. I have to say, Pataki's in third position. As they come up to the finish now, the lead out, and Hushoft is he going to pull off the big surprise as Tor Hushoft breaks for the line. Now where? There is the Max Missile, there he goes, over the top, somebody just launched him, and forget it, because Mark Cavendish is streets ahead of the Tour de France when it comes to a sprint finish. He will open for Mark Cavendish, 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 For once they are giving Mark Cavendish a run for his money. They've got the tactics right, there's no doubt. Here comes the counter-attack, a one kilometer to go. Second position is Mark Renshaw, third position Cavendish. Renshaw looking over his shoulder to see where Cavendish is. Look at the speed of the riders over the road. It was a very tight corner that as they line up, they can see the finish now. This is Mark Renshaw, the fastest leader man in the business, and there's the missile. He's locked onto his wheel now. This is going to be a formality. Win at number six for Mark Cavendish. There's nobody can match the speed of this amazing kid. He has got the victory, and no British cyclist has ever, ever been remotely close. This road is opening up the sprint. Luis Leo Sanchez and Paulinho go ahead, cuts the missile. In the white jersey grits his teeth, he chases Luis Leo Sanchez, he locks in, but can he get by? Roach is so close to winning this, he swings across the road. Cavendish has just won his second stage the Tour de France. He joins the great sprinter. What a finish, and that's going to be one of his best ever victories. Here we go, the full commitment. It's also all about timing your effort to perfection here. There's Gareth Thomas on the far left. He nearly collided with the barriers. Australia now really beginning to flex their muscles at the front.